Hi and welcome. My name is Stefan Burns. I'm an applications geophysicist with Geometrics. And today I'm here to show you how to use our Geometrics Survey Manager for magnetometers. To start, you can open up our Survey Manager. And you'll notice there's two sections, Instrument Type and Acquisitions. Now, if, re if you've recently picked up one of these, nice brand new shiny mag arrow, you'd want to click Super Mag. If you have a older version, you can also do dual sensors or our G864 magnetometer. And what our Survey Manager software does is it takes the raw data that's output from your instrument and converts it into a CSV file for use in Surfer, GeoSoft Oasis Montage, or a variety of other data processing and analysis software packages. So again, we've chosen our instrument type, Mag Arrow Super Mag, and let's put in a survey name. Mag Arrow Survey. At this point, you can hit Save. We'll save this to the desktop. This is Mag Arrow Survey. Now we can import an acquisition. So we go to File, Import Acquisition. An acquisition is the data that you collected in the field. So I've already put acquisition data from a mag arrow on my desktop. So right now I'm on the desktop and there's survey y0 aqu1.mag data. This is a data format. You can see here it's about 31 kil 31,000 kilobytes and you can't open that up in really any software. So you open that up and it takes some time to load. It is uh, about 31 megabytes. You can also use the software with a G864, uh, which is our newest LAN magnetometer and it comes with the new software in uh, tablet UI. Okay, so we've successfully imported all our records. Hit OK. Now you can go to the acquisition box and you can go to the drop down open up ACQU01. You can look at the ID, the name, the mouse samples, and when the last measurement was taken. From here, you can click export data or delete acquisition. For the purpose of this video, we wanna export the data. So here's our desktop. And we'll, again, we'll call this Mag Arrow Survey. And you notice a CSV at the end there, dot .csv. Do not delete that. If you delete that dot .csv, it comes out as a, just a file. If you keep the CSV, it comes out as a CSV file. Hit save. You'll see our export screen up here in the top left. And we now exported that CSV file. Hit OK. If you have multiple acquisitions, you need to transfer into a CSV file. You can run through the same steps. You can choose your survey name. You can save it, import your acquisition, and then you can export your data. And here is our file. Now you have a survey dbt. This is the, the, the survey file we created, right? When we first open, we create that survey file. And then this is our actual data file, our CSV data file, Mag Arrow Survey. You can see it has the Excel. We click on it. It'll take a while to load. 31 megabytes, but it's a lot of data points. A lot of data points. Again, our Mag Arrow samples at a, a 1,000 uh, hertz uh, sample rate. So every millisecond is collecting a data point. And here you can see 
the different file formats. So the different data column formats. So the counter is the, uh, the sample that you're on with your time, latitude, too long, mag reading, different accelerometer, accelerometer, compass, and gyroscope readings. And then also, this is your GPS string right here. And this, you only see every 1,000 records because the GPS has a one hertz sample rate. So you have to scroll quite a ways in there to find that next one. If you want an accurate GPS, GPS location for every data point, you have to interpolate in between. But that sums up the conclusion of this video, which is how to use the Geometric Survey Manager. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Or go to our website, www.gmetrics.com, and contact us through our support page. Thank you for your time.